after seeing all of the devastation from Helene, so many people want to get involved. They want to help. So we want to make sure you have everything you need to know in case you want to volunteer, donate, or if you need help yourself as recovery efforts ramp up in North Carolina. If you want to donate supplies, the Durham Rescue Mission is holding a supply drive through Monday. You can drop off supplies at 1201 East Main Street in Durham. They're looking for first aid supplies, non-perishable food, and personal hygiene supplies as well. If you're looking to donate money, the state set up the North Carolina Disaster Relief Fund through United Way. You can donate by heading to ncdot.gov backslash donate. The Red Cross and Salvation Army are also accepting donations. But if you are going to donate money, it's important you double check that you're donating to a reputable organization as scammers often try to take advantage during times of tragedy. If you want to volunteer to help those affected by Helene, you can head to ncvoad.org to learn more about how to get involved. And if you need help in the wake of this storm, there is free storm and debris cleanup through crisis cleanup. There's a hotline you can call to get help with this. They are taking requests through Friday, October 11th. There's also information about financial and housing assistance on USA.gov. And if you need help finding a loved one, the best place to go is disasterassistance.gov. If you're planning on heading to Western North Carolina to be part of the relief effort, make sure you check drivenc.gov as a large portion of the roads in the western part of the state remain closed. State officials are urging you not to head to the affected areas unless you are actively helping. Just going to see the damage can hinder recovery efforts. Of course, all of this information along with links and phone numbers, everything you need to know is posted right now on our website, abc11.com. I'm Sydney Schofield, ABC 11 Eyewitness News.